Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in to uh, Apprehensive Films video blog number two. Uh, I'm Jonathan Morgan, president of Apprehensive Films, and we're almost to October now. Uh, Halloween is right around the corner. We've got some really good stuff happening. Uh, first, we've got the Halloween Home Haunts world premiere here in Sacramento, California. So if you're a local Sacramento resident, um, you can check out the, uh, the movie. We're showing it at a haunted house that was featured in the film. We'll get generally two or three reports each night of people who feed their pants. <laughs> On October 19th uh, at Heartstoppers, downtown Sacramento, uh, 7.30 p.m. Definitely check it out. Halloween Home Haunts playing at a haunted house. That's about as cool as it gets in my book. Um, other good stuff happening. We just licensed a, a, a new film. Uh, called Children of Dracula. It's a documentary on people who believe they're real-life vampires. The undead. The ghost or spirit of a dead person, which issues forth at night to suck blood from the living. Join us as we examine the strange belief and practices of modern-day vampires in Children of Dracula. Real interviews with real vampires. We'll have that out uh, in a lot of the uh, online retailers and stuff by the end of October. That's the plan on that one. Um, also, is going to be on uh, all the digital, all the digital uh, platforms. You know, iTunes, all that kind of stuff. So look for Children of Dracula coming soon. Uh, we got some great cover art we're working on, uh, and it's uh, produced and directed by. Um, uh, Brett McCormick, who did, uh, who was famous for The Abomination. He produced The Abomination, the uh, Super 8 feature in the 80s that was very gory, you know, a big VHS cult item. Um, <clears throat> and he also did Ozone, uh, Attack of the Redneck Mutants. He produced a lot of, a lot of really cool stuff, uh, and Children of Dracula was one of his films that never came out. We licensed it from Wax Movies. Uh, and it's looking like it's going to be a lot of fun. Finally, people are going to get to discover this really cool documentary on, on real-life vampires. Um, also, we have uh, Halloween Home Haunts. Uh, this is the DVD, but the soundtrack is out now. Uh, you, so if you, if you like the haunt music featured on the movie, uh, you can download the soundtrack. It's on iTunes, it's on CD Baby, uh, Amazon, all the major uh, digital uh, platforms for music. Uh, soundtracks by Tony Longworth. Uh, some of his music is featured in this video blog that you're seeing right now. Uh, he's a really talented guy, does stuff specific for haunts sometimes. Um, really creepy, moody stuff, so definitely check out the Halloween Home Haunts uh, soundtrack when you get a chance. Um, also, since we're back in the Halloween season, uh, our release from last year, uh, the All Night Halloween Party, um, has picked up some steam. It's doing very well. Sales, sales are uh, up on that one. Uh, it's a really cool, fun disc that uh, it has an auto loop feature so it keeps going uh, and it's meant for the background of your Halloween party so it goes as long as your Halloween party does. It's the all night Halloween party, the disc that never stops. It's a bunch of vintage Halloween cartoons uh, spaced out with some vintage horror movie trailers so it's a, it's a lot of fun. Um, another really cool thing we have coming up that we hope to have out right before uh, Halloween here is there's Orlock the Vampire in 3D. This is a release from a couple of years ago. Um, but we are bringing it out in a giant big box, coffin box set. Uh, there's going to be artwork on the front of the box, on the back of the box, inside. You're going to get all kinds of cool stuff. You'll get the DVD, you're going to get vampire fangs, wax fangs, blood, all kinds of neat stuff. Um, so that's coming, you know, towards the end of October as well. Should have the pre-sale up on that pretty soon. With artwork's done. There's going to be two different... Uh, variations on the art, variant tiles, and um, they're uh, it's limited edition, so there's going to be I think we're going to make 25 to 50 a piece, you know, so uh, you definitely want to pick that up as soon as it comes out. And our final last bit of news for this video blog is that we are another Sacramento piece of news. We're sponsoring the Sacramento Horror Film Festival, which happens uh, uh, October 11th through the 13th this year. Uh, so all the films that uh, you know, any, anything that wins a prize, you know, jury selection, audience selection. Uh, we are considering for distribution and head down the road on DVD, VOD, cable, all that kind of stuff. So that's pretty much all the news we have right now. Thanks for tuning into the video blog, and we'll see you next time. <laughs>